grandmas love to spoil their grandchildren. Especially when the grandma has a suitcase full of cash she doesn't know what to do with. Whoa. Oh my. <laughs> Did you mean to give us $10 bills? Because these are hundreds. I'm gonna kick your ass. I know it's a lot, but why not see you enjoy it while I'm still around? Ooh, there's an inheritance too? Well, it depends on how you treat me in my golden years. I'm not interested in your money. You're pretty and I love you. Now, don't you have something to say to me? I'm Thank rich. You. Do you have a calculator I can borrow? Yes, but I'm using it. No, you're not. Why do you need a calculator? I'm trying to figure out what to spend my money on. What are you going to do with yours? I'm glad you asked. I'm dipping my toe in the exciting world of the stock market by purchasing three shares of Radio Shack. Why? Well, as a shareholder, I'll be partial owner of my very favorite company. See, when companies go public, they sell shares of I'll stock. i buy my own calculator. I'd only been a shareholder for one day, and I was already reveling in the giddy thrill in being part owner of a thriving tech company. Hello, Radio Shack. Sheldon Cooper, shareholder. I just wanted to let you know I'm so excited to be part of the team. While I sound young, rest assured, I'm far more intelligent than my age would imply. So if there's anything I can do to help, budgeting, product design, finding a word more impressive than Shaq, I'm your man. My sister had taken a different path with her money. What is that? It's a cotton candy machine. Why? It's a machine that makes free cotton candy. It's not free. You paid for it. Mima paid for it. And it's still better than lame stocks. You're going to end up with a stomach ache while I get to be part of America's favorite electronics retailer. What's up? I figured out you can put all kinds of candy in the machine. Try this. Why is it brown? It's butterscotch from Mima's candy bowl. I think that candy's older than you. Doesn't taste like it. Not bad. I'm gonna bring a bunch to school. How much you gonna charge for it? Nothing. They're my friends. You think Ronald McDonald let his friends eat for free? Ronald McDonald isn't real. The point is, you shouldn't give this away for free. How much would I even charge? Hmm. How about 50 cents? They only cost me like two cents to make. Yeah, but you're not factoring in your time and the cost of the machine you bought and the value of the brain power it took to think of butterscotch cotton candy. Yeah. No one else thought of putting old lady candy in the cotton candy machine. Why should they get it for free? Welcome to business. Thank you for having me. So I said 70 cents for one or two for a dollar, and everyone bought two. People love a deal. I know. I sold out. Then you got to start charging more. How much more? Just raise the price a little at a time until you see your profits top out. I'm learning, but it's fun. This is weird. Think they'd pay a dollar a piece? Sure. Just tell them it's a special limited edition. People go nuts for that. Like the Shamrock Shake. Exactly. Every year I'm like, this tastes like toothpaste. But every year I buy it. Kick. House music.